I'm Brian from Citex Technologies. You can contact me with this information. Please go to facebook.com slash technologies to like my page so that you can have all the latest information regarding my company and also SQL accounting system. In today's lesson, I'll continue with Purchase module in SQL accounting system Purchase order As normal, when you go to any of the transaction screen, the first page you see will be the listing of that particular transaction Over here, you can see your listing of purchase order The first row is empty, so it is for you to do a quick search Maybe you want to use a company name to do searching Okay, so you click key COM, then your maxis will come up because COM is in the middle. At any point of time, if you see column like this, you can always click at one of the columns here to few choose. You can pull those required fields that you want, drag, drop. Then you can have your attention over here. If you want to keep this this way, just right click again, do a few grid layout, save layout, give a name, let's say default. Then remember to take set this layout as default layout. If you do this, when you go out and come in again, the layout will still be there. The things also can directly export to your Excel. Let's start with a new purchase order. There are two ways to create a purchase order. First one, you still need to select your supplier, as Maxis. As mentioned, why I key MA, the Maxis will come out, is because it's highlighted under company name, which means I'm using the company name to do a searching. You click at tab, you jump to another column, tab, 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 again, you can come back. So we access. The first way is if you do create a purchase request previously, then you can right click the purchase order, then transfer from your purchase request. For example, we request for two that manager only accept one, this one accept. So it will transfer over. Then you can have your purchase order. You can preview your purchase order. Okay, you can uh, do the customization for the format, which I'll teach you in future. Then all our uh, document or report can directly export to ex uh, format. Just click at print, take print. You can select PDF or other format. Then just select where you want to save and save it. Then you can have your PDF format which enable you to direct email to your customer or for this one is supplier okay you can always go back to a particular purchase order edit it maybe you want to put a new item no problem okay. more you can select project you can select a different delivery maybe you want your supplier to deliver to your customer then over here you need to maintain your customer address over your supplier site under the branch which you can select under over here okay so basically this is how you to do a purchase order in SQL account system this is my contact information, I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. Thank you.